That's his happy face. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to Worship Wednesday. Um, here we are, another week. Full disclosure, this is actually round two. This will give you an idea of how our week personally is going some of the time. Uh, we had a nice, I don't know, when people don't want to call it a fight, they call it a discussion, but it was just a fight um, before this. And I uh, belligerently started doing it by myself. And then as I started singing the songs and recording this, um, I just, I kind of knew we were supposed to do this together and then it wasn't right. So anyways, this is round two. And I say that to say, welcome wherever you are at we're glad you're here mm -hmm. it's been a tough few days i think would you agree with that nathaniel yes yeah what's been tough for you the cold the lack of sun mm -hmm. or that we and our kids are trapped inside the house yeah a lot yeah it is amazing how much the weather can just mm -hmm. throw off like our kids and actually today we're having a pretty decent day and doing creative things like <clears throat> sliding down our stairs uh, you can check out my facebook if you want to see some video of that on mattresses that levi had put there it's really steep and maybe partially dangerous but um really fun so they were actually doing pretty well today in a lot of ways but i still just felt so out of it and there's something about yeah when the sun's not out when it's just a little cold and dreary like this with everything else currently going on that just makes life feel heavier <laughs> so i don't know i don't know i think maybe it's saying that they were doing well is a little generous they were playing by themselves together a lot more today. I'm not, I mean, our kids are crazy. So, but they actually, I even had offered them some media time a couple times and they really wanted to keep like sliding and playing together. And that's not always the case. That's true. So in that sense, I could tell that my mood wasn't just like a result of them having this terrible day, but that I was just having my own kind of bad day. So Anyways, man, guys, it just can be really hard sometimes with everything going on. Um, we don't really have super exciting questions tonight, unless Nathaniel comes up with something on the fly. But one thing, oh, Annie is on a well-deserved break this week. I'm really glad that that is happening. So, yay. So, yeah, that's why it's us this time. It's part of your quarantine. But... One question she had thought of is she was curious what you guys might be watching on YouTube because sometimes stuff pops up like if you're watching the services on YouTube and maybe not on YouTube normally other things kind of come up. So she wanted to know what you're watching. Um, something I <laughs> thought of. This isn't new or exciting or in necessarily for everyone but I um <laughs> I've gotten kind of into these things called, what are they called, Nathaniel? I, total Shreds. Total Shreds. And they're basically voiceovers of live musical performances. And these people have voiced them over really well. And it's, it's, it's ridiculous, but also quite fun. And so probably my favorite one, I think Nathaniel's looking them up now. Possibly. I don't know. I'm just looking for... What I've actually oh, I okay. Actually That's watch good. It that often. Um, my favorite is by One Direction. They do Story of My Life. So if you look up Total Shreds on YouTube, Story of My Life, if you haven't seen it, it is really, really funny and kind of ridiculous, but lighthearted, just silly. Nathaniel, did you have something? Okay. Yeah, there's this other channel called Everything is Terrible. That's, it's mainly just clips of, I don't know, VHS from the 80s. <laughs> okay. Mostly bad Christian programming from the 80s. Nice. So. Nice. <laughs> there's a lot to be ashamed of. Oh, there. that sounds kind of fun. I don't think I've watched those with you. It's not always appropriate. But okay, sure. Oh, that's another one. If you guys haven't watched um, 
some good news with John Krasinski, who was on Jim on The Office. Um, they are what they say. It's him doing like a fake news thing called Some Good News, and they're really uplifting and lighthearted and and sweet and mm. fun. Mm. So I also highly recommend those, especially if you're just needing a little pick me up um, and just have a few minutes. They're like I don't know, ten twenty minutes long. Really, really great though. Those are on YouTube. They're really fun. So that was Andy's question. My question, um, not as necessarily fun, but I just want to know what, how are you guys doing this week? And maybe is there anything hard that's happened this week? If you want to be really brave on Slack chat, you on our channel, you could type in, is there, if there's any way that we could be praying for you? Um, I know I need it a lot right now. So if anything pops up, uh, we'd love to have you share that and yeah, we can support each other and love each other in those places. So put it in if you got something. And then last but not least, I'm sure you have a lot of people you want to award this to. Do I? <laughs> Probably not. But most extra. Um, I have a couple really notable ones. First of all, and she will not enjoy that I'm doing this, but I'm doing it anyways. I award the most extra to Annie for continuing to keep worship going worship Wednesday and Sundays tirelessly every week just leading out of obedience and faith and I just am pretty blown away by how that's gone so um yeah Annie most extra um I award this to you Second of all, I want to award this to a few people, a few very important people, and I award the most extra to the office staff, who is just, um, they're just, yeah, they're doing so much right now. So, Emily, Amy, Devana, Karen for Kids Ministry, and Aaron um, Stevens for um, Youth. You guys are incredible, just what you're keeping going. Work is really hard right now. I actually can't imagine having uh, two jobs of the, the kids and a job outside the home. The one seems challenging enough, so juggling that and, and serving our church in that way, you guys are absolutely most extra, and yeah, super impressed by you guys. So those are my most extra awards. Not quite as fun as last week where we awarded Highway 44 and Murder Hornets, but um, still well-deserved and important. So, thanks, guys. Um, all right. Should we move into worship? Okay. Oh, wait. Did you think of something? Someone? Hold on. No, not really. Oh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> um, yeah, we're going to do four songs tonight. Um... It's good to be with you guys. We are tired. Um, but I just keep finding myself coming back to Jesus and needing him really desperately in these spots where it's just hard. And there's not there's not really an insight to some of that. So uh, let's pray. Holy Spirit. We invite you and we expect you to come. Thank you that we can fully trust you. Thank you, Jesus, that you are good and that you are safety. And that you promise we can go to you and you will you'll keep us safe. So come right now, bring, bring the experience of who you are and bring your presence in a way that we just, we know you're with us. Amen. We're going to start with Fall Afresh. Thank you. 
actually one of my probably my one of my favorite all all time favorite worship songs 
something just so um, comforting about it, like singing it. Sometimes I feel like I'm just going home, and I think there's something in just declaring who you know, Father, Son, Holy Spirit are, and then just like offering that praise to them. That is so beautiful. So. Yeah, wherever you're at, however you're able to join in, um, love love to sing, love for you guys to sing along together with us. Um, so yeah, let's close with this.
thank you for who you are. Thank you for who you have always been and who you will always be. That you are consistent and true and we can put our whole hope and trust fully on you and not be disappointed. Amen. Thanks for joining us, guys. Um, yeah, it's good to know that we are having these moments, although we're apart, <laughs> but there is this, this place that we can kind of come together. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for sticking with us and um, worshiping with us and hopefully laughing some tonight too. Um, we love you guys. We miss you guys. And we can't wait till the day that we get to be back together. But let's keep pressing into him. Keep reaching out. Keep asking for help when you need it. And asking for prayer. Again, seriously, if you have prayer requests, uh, post them on here. Um, we would love to be praying for whatever's going on. So we will see you guys next time.